Anti-psychotic drugs sent home with a battleground 14-month-old. The infant's, infant's parents say it's the hospital's mistake. Good evening and thanks for watching. I'm Dan Klein. For almost 12 hours, the infant took anti-psychotic meds and sin of anti-nausea meds. The girl's parents say a nurse at Franciscan St. Elizabeth Central made the air. New Channel 18's Kristen Mayorano sat down in an exclusive interview with the family. Can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. <laughs> Fourteen-month-old Gabby Abston was showing signs of her upbeat self Tuesday afternoon, but her mother Tiffany Abston says earlier in the day that wasn't the case. She's been, I mean, she's been asleep all day. She hasn't really ah. ate much either, so... Mm. That's kind of scary. The Epstein's doctor told her those are the side effects of an antipsychotic medication given to their daughter by the nursing staff at Franciscan St. Elizabeth Central. Tiffany took Gabby there Monday night for an upset stomach and thought she was leaving with anti-nausea pill Zofran, which was written on the prescription sheet. She says hospital staff apparently didn't realize the mistake until nearly 12 hours later when they called her Tuesday morning around 7.15. They wanted me to go into her bedroom and make sure that she woke up. And it's been kind of chaotic since. <laughs> a moment that Tiffany and her husband Travis say left them shell shocked. What would have happened if she wouldn't have woke up? Officials at Franciscan St. Elizabeth say due to privacy law they can't discuss the case, but in a statement said, We take any incident in our hospital very seriously. We are committed to the safety of our patients and providing the best quality of care. The director of the Indiana Poison Center won't comment on this case specifically, but says it may not be an isolated incident. Problem. Um, there's actually been an Institute of Medicine report that's been put out on the about the problem of medication errors. News that was not a comfort to the Epstein family, who hopes to warn other families about the issue. Eventually, they're going to kill somebody from it. Kristen Mayorano, News Channel 18. The Epstein say the Poison Center told them hospitals are required to notify patients within six hours if they were given the wrong medicine, but Dr. Mowry says he does not believe any law mandates that.